Okay, so let's do this. Let's have a quick look at uh, this whole situation. This is uh, the assault on Ve uh, Viaville, and it, this is the demo system from Lock and Load. And what we're going to do here is uh, have a quick look at what the vector conditions are, which is, uh, and then and, you know, where the what the forces are, and then we'll we'll jump into the gameplay and kind of go from there. So, starting from hex H seven here, you can see that. And I'm sorry about the autofocus there. Uh, you can see that what we need to do based on the VCs is, as the German player control four building hexes within three hexes of this hex. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, Americans start out with control of all of these hexes and that's just kind of the way it rolls. And the, the Germans are going to uh, enter the map either from the north, east or west. We don't really know yet where they're going to enter. I don't believe, let's see. Turn one, SSR, rule number one. Well, that would be a mistake there. Enter on turn one, per, oh, SSR three, trying to read the rules, Kevin. Randomly determined. So we roll a D6, let's do that, and get that out of the way. Five, three, five, five and six is the west edge, and I believe that's north. So we now we know where we're coming on, and we will uh, kind of go at it from there. The German forces start out with uh, two, uh, three squads that are one six, which means it's a one firepower, uh, six range, four movement points, a leader with a morale rating each of seven. The squads have morale ratings of five. There's a medic. No, you can't see the guys. That would really help, wouldn't it? Uh, leaders, squads. MGs, Medic, <coughs> etc. The Americans have uh, a 254 squad here, another 254 there. So you can see they have a higher firepower per squad. Uh, there's a 144, which is a reduced, possibly uh, a reduced uh, unit. And uh, he has a big honk in uh, 1919. I guess that's almost like... Is that a 50 cal? Or Marduce? Is that what they call that? I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, that's set up there. And objective is to control these hexes. So that's all the video I'm going to shoot for the moment. We know who has the initiative first. That's the Germans. And we will look for them to come on the board. And we'll kind of carry on from there. It's a six-turn scenario. There are two, uh, where it actually, this line of sight thing goes somewhere. I think it goes here. There's the woods. Right here. Now, this is supposed to be B, but the count is pr uh, printed A. There's two A's. Unless it's on the back here. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Event B. So, event B and event A. When they, become, when they come into the line of sight of various sides, depending on probably the Germans, uh, then there's a special scenario of rules that it's going to activate some reinforcements. And, it, and I'll tell you now, it's reinforcements for both sides, right? So that's, that's kind of how all that works. And let me get a sip of water because I've got a dry throat. <clears throat> and we'll kind of go for it from there. Talk to you soon.